This video will demonstrate how to calibrate your microscope camera in HDMI mode. In order to calibrate your microscope, you will first need a stage micrometer. Stage micrometer is the device as seen on the image now, which is a line of known reference. In this case, my total line length is one millimeter, which makes each individual tick mark 0.01 millimeters. It's important to know this factor ahead of time to ensure for the most accurate calibrations. When ready, with your micrometer in focus, Navigate the mouse up to the upper part of the screen and this window will appear. Selecting the calibration icon, which is the one right here that says calibrate when you hover over it, will bring up my calibration wizard. From here, you want to select the magnification that you're calibrating on. If you have a compound microscope with one of these preset objectives, you can simply select the magnification. To enter your own magnification, just simply double click in the magnification box and this keyboard will appear. Next, what you want to do is you want to position the red lines that come up overlaid with your stage micrometer. Since I can see the whole stage micrometer, I'm going to go across the whole length to ensure for the most accurate degree of measurements. So in this case, I'm going to drag the right side to the end bar and I'm going to drag my left side to the left end bar. Now, when you're at higher magnifications, it's important to note that you start and end from the same side of your line. Meaning if you're starting from the left side of my zero tick mark here, I want to end at the left side of my zero, uh, my hundred mark. So in this case, I'm starting from the right side to the right side. As seen here, I know that the total line length in millimeters is going to be one millimeter. So I select my unit of measurement here millimeters. I give it my actual line length. Again, double clicking in here will bring up my keyboard in the bottom. I select one millimeter and I click OK. Now my software is calibrated in HDMI mode for my 10x objective. You will repeat this process for each magnification that you need calibrated. Once you're done, you'll notice a drop down of all magnifications that are calibrated up here. It is very important that before you make any measurements, you confirm that the magnification of the objective shown here matches the magnification of the objective on your microscope. Once done, to confirm that I have an accurate calibration, we can simply draw a line and make sure that it matches. In this case, I'm going to go from there to here, which should be 0.1 millimeter and a little crooked, but 0.1 millimeter. We know we're accurately calibrated and we can start working and making measurements. Thanks for watching. For any questions, give us a call.